Hello there, Ivy. Hey, Grandma Elizabeth. How's it going? Tip top, Ivy. I was wondering about something. Do you know why we have bones? Well, have you ever been to a boneless chicken ranch, Ivy? I'll tell you, it's not a pretty thing. Oh, yeah, I guess it would be kind of hard to walk around if we didn't have bones. We'd be more like a jellyfish. Right you are, Ivy. I wonder if there are any other ways we use bones. Oh. Hmm, well, I guess our skull doesn't help us move around, does it? If it is not moving us around, what's it doing? Doesn't it protect the brain? Well, Ivy, I guess you are right. It does protect the brain. I wonder if there are any other bones that help to protect vital organs? I'm pretty sure that the ribs do that too. I was looking at a picture in my science textbook and it showed that the heart and lungs, liver and stomach, pancreas and spleen are all hidden by the ribs. Right again, Ivy. The ribs do protect your internal organs. Did you know that the ribs and the sternum, or breastbone, make up the thorax? I did not know that, Granny. Thanks for telling me that. Thanks for the coffee. I'll see you later. See you later, Ivy.